Brandon, the RV guru here, and I'm down at Mr. Motorhome in Sacramento, home of Northern California's cleanest used RVs. He's been here in Sacramento for 32 years now without a single customer complaint. He's got an A-plus rating by the Better Business Bureau, something he's very proud of. And today I've got a 1999 Safari Zanzibar. Now your Safari is going to be a diesel push, of course, and it's the same uh, manufacturer as, say, your Beaver Jasper Edition, $600,000 coach. When those guys aren't making their $600,000 Beavers, they're down making these Safaris. A couple things to point out here is a ton of storage space. Leave the tents at home, the kids can sleep right down here, and take a look at how clean this area is. A lot of times you open this up and it'll be all stained up from people throwing in all their muddy gear, their camp gear, camp chairs, fishing poles, tackle box, stuff like that. And this one is in perfect shape. It looks like it just rolled off the assembly line. You've got these huge storage doors. They stay up by themselves, and they're well insulated. If you can see that right here, you've got nice padding there. A little more storage here. Just a massive compartment for anything you could possibly think about taking. One tent plugs on the outside. So you wanted to plug in a, a television or outside entertainment center, you could. Huge one touch awning. That's an electric awning. All you do is push a button, that thing will come right on out. Now take a look at this. If you notice, that's actually an aluminum cover that's gonna help protect the vinyl underneath from getting eaten up by the sun. And then of course, your windows here, they're uh, nicely tinted. You've got a very dark UV tinting, which is gonna give you a lot of privacy and help protect all the fabric on the inside from sun damage and sun fading. Not only that, but it's gonna help to keep the inside of your coach cool. Not to mention, if we can take a look at that, those are dual pane windows. They're safety tempered glass, so you never have to worry about a stray softball in the campground coming out and smashing through your window. Your tempered glass is gonna be two and a half times stronger than regular glass. It's a big 330 cat motor. Your cat's gonna have plenty of power to pull you up those hills, and it's already set up to tow. Won't have any trouble doing that. You've got a 10,000 pound hitch on this guy. So just about anything you could possibly want to tow, you'd be able to do. Back in the back here. Your heart dynamic power inverter. And what that does is it converts all the 12 volt power in your coach. And this one, I think you've got six batteries into 110 power. So you can shut the generator off at night flip that guy on and still watch TV. Take a look at this. Now this is really important. This is where your dump station is. And a couple things I want to point out is down below here there's your a connection for your sewer hose. Everything's nicely labeled. You've got your gray tank, uh, your black tank and your gray tank and they're color coordinated so you won't ever get confused. Here's your drinking water here, your potable drinking water. And then down here is your sandy flesh. So you've got a built-in sewer hose in that black tank you can hook a water hose to, and that's going to turn on and spin everything out of there and really flush it out nicely. Outside shower. And then this is really important. This is a must-have if you're shopping for a nice diesel pusher. What this is, is you'll notice everything's labeled. You've got a uh, galley, uh, let's see, ice maker, optional ice maker, tub and shower. And what that is, is let's say you're camping and you're having a great time and uh-oh, something happens and you sprung, a leak in your, uh, you sprung a leak in your ice maker, the plumbing lines that lead up to your ice maker. Well, you can flip a switch and that's going to kill all the water that goes to that line, but it's still going to allow you to have water, say, to your bath and shower or to your kitchen sink. Really important. It's not going to ruin your trip if you spring a leak. You just turn it off right at the source there and it still allows you to use the rest of your coach as normal. Big power windows. It's a very nice looking coach. Check out the graphics. You'll notice they're not badly sun faded. They're not all cracked and peeling. 
This thing's in great shape. You've got the nice fiberglass roof right up above there. And something people always ask, they're always asking me, Brandon, how are the tires? Because tires on these diesel pushers can get expensive. Now take a look at this. This is the condition of your tire. You'll notice there's no sidewall cracking anywhere. All the tread is in great shape. So these have a lot of life left in them. No worries about having to replace very expensive tires right away. Wouldn't be very hard for you to sink $3,000 into these tires. Be a great motorhome. Now let's take a look at the inside.